But we're hoping Jack, maybe to start, you could give us a bit of a rev up. I can tell you a joke. Yeah? Yeah, here go we on. go. Here we go. Gotcha. Them two suits are pretty bad. <laughs> <laughs> Is that the setup or the punchline? <laughs> Just a straight insult. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> insult comic. Very insult good. Insult comic. All right. Uh, this one's from an at Dom Sheed. Um, he says, it's every boy's dream to win a grand final on the siren. What's it like to win one on the opening siren? <laughs> Not partake on me in that. Not partake. Because <laughs> it, it, it was obvious pretty early last year. At what point during the, the national anthem did you know you had it in the bag? <laughs> Again, no Geez, your media train. Oh, yeah, you guys are very <laughs> Not going to gloat at all. No. This is beautiful. From Tiger Tim, and this is a safe place. Yeah, safe place. We turn the cameras off, but <laughs> good there, all. Did you throw it? No free kick. It was on a knife's edge. He got it. No one's tackling him, so he hasn't called a throw. Is this? That's a throw, isn't it? It is a throw, but they yeah, can't but... overrule that. Did you? You did. We've watched that a few times. Can no, it look? Yeah. Yeah. It looks. Uh, Daniel, uh, uh, do you reckon he threw it? Threw what? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm going to take that as a... Nah, I didn't throw it, mate. You throw it? All right. I'm going to feel fit here now. <laughs> <laughs> but he's turned on us. <laughs> he's turned on those cameras back on. We're not getting what we need it. <laughs> All right, this one, uh, this one actually is for you, Trent. It's uh, from an at Jack Higgins. Hey, Koch, why do you let me give the three-quarter time speech after Hardwick has just given us a spray? What's the go there? What does he say? What's he saying? The first issue is, um, I don't think that is Jack because his sentence wouldn't have made sense. <laughs> <laughs> and secondly, that's pretty much what comes out of his mouth at three quarter time is not a lot of sense and typically relaxes the voice. So that's why we let him talk a lot of gibberish. It was young Jack Higgins who was giving them the fire up speech there and a couple of the boys included, including Dusty, uh, enjoyed that one and loved what Jack had to say. Um, now this is from an at Serena Williams. I won seven Australian Opens. I spent one night on the tiles with Dusty Martin and got bailed out of the Australian Open in the third round. How do you blokes do a whole season with him? <laughs> I don't hang around him, so. <laughs> <laughs> What's the go there? Why were you and how were you hanging out with Serena Williams? Um, just through mutual friends and yeah, that's all there is to it. There's not a big story. Nah. Just... I'm scared of the bloke. I've known him for three years, I'm still scared. Uh, hey, yeah. Jack, we had him in here before, oh, I was shitting my pants. Yeah. I'll be honest with you. Uh, yeah. Just hanging out. Yeah. Australia didn't think so, did No. It? No. Yeah, there was, wasn't, we were just, yeah, just hanging out. He's still nervous. He's not out there still, is he? Has he gone home? No, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs>